Hello, Joey Gates here, CrowQuill66. Vector objects with bones and dynamics. I'm going to create on level zero here, or frame zero, I'm going to create a basic shape. And then I'm going to add a few points to help with flexibility. I'm going to come over to my layers palette and choose bone layer. Then I'm going to go and add some bones here, like that. And I'm going to take that vector layer and drop it, drag it up and drop it onto the bone layer. With the bone layer selected, I can come over here, select this tool, and I can see basically how this has influence on that. Now I can increase or decrease the amount of influence like that. Now what I need to do in order to have this have some dynamics, some physical properties of let's go ahead and animate this layer. Um, I'm going to put it in a group. You don't have to, but I like to put that so that I'm actually moving the group not the bone layer itself. So let's put, first of all, let's put the bone properties, the dynamics on these bones. I'm going to select these bones like this and say bone dynamics. You can adjust each bone um, so that there's better fall off on that. Now what I'm going to do is animate this layer like this. I'm going to move that over there set a key here and then on frame 48 I'm going to set a key there and let's see what happens okay let's try that again nice